we decided to sleep in the car last night because it's actually really scary <clears throat> sleeping out here in a tent, not at a camping ground. So, and now it's breakfast time. Making some oats, feeling our oats. Feeling something. <laughs> feeling a little cut. Good. It was full of rubbish, just everywhere, and it's just so... It's really sad. I want to say it's sad, but they're the ones that are littering. It's them, it's no one else. But the thing I don't understand is that this, what we're driving on now, <laughs> on this rocky road, is their indigenous land, and if they want to protect this land, why are they filling it with rubbish? Because that's not us littering. Because everywhere we've stopped, we've made it a point you to... You picked up? We, I literally was picking up other people's litter that were left in a camping site. Well, not a camping site, but on the side of the road where we stopped. And putting in our rubbish. Like, you know, we're looking after this, but why aren't they? You would think if it was like sacred land that it would be looked after, not malnourished and destroyed. I just find it really sad, environmentally, to be honest. I just want to shower. That's <laughs> not what you get. And phone reception. <laughs> not what you get. Oh, you look the fun. Literally. <laughs> Little bit of each other, you have signal. <laughs> you have signal? <laughs> you have fucking fun! <laughs> How's everyone feeling? <laughs> Let, it out. Let it out. Let what out? I just honestly, I feel exhausted. So do I, I'm really tired. I was just falling asleep and drooling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well imagine how I feel. How many days left until back to Geraldine? What's today? Is it Thursday or Wednesday or I what? think it's Wednesday. Thursday. Is it Thursday? <laughs> but we'll be home on Saturday then. Oh. <laughs> I just want to be back in like first world country. Well, we've got 2,000 more Ks to drive. That's so far. And we've already used a whole tank of fuel. <laughs> oh my god. Hopefully we can get home and not die. Well, we, we have no tarp. So. Oh yeah, and <laughs> Aboriginals stole our tarp. <laughs> Can you believe that? There was native indigenous people that stole <laughs> our tarp. <laughs> they climbed on the roof and took the tarp. When we were in, <laughs> in the gas station. In the gas station <laughs> getting the mini food. In <laughs> and Bruce is going to have a bowel movement. Yeah, Bruce is going to take a shit in the bush. <laughs> well, there's no bushes, but I'll go somewhere. Mm, Bruce is going to take a shit on the stone. Mm, I can actually feel it coming out. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Was... Get me the fuck out of here. Okay, well... I'm off to go build a tent and take a shit.
<laughs> My hair smells like burnt product. Uh, I smell like a wet dog. <laughs> <laughs> it was worth it though. <laughs> Another day flows by. Time travel gone astray. My mind in disarray. I could have run away to be with you. I could have run away to be with you. So Bruce is taking a shit in the bush. We're gonna try Scott and I gonna try and drive off. Oh my <laughs> do we have to change this? <laughs> You have to do like gears and stuff. Because <laughs> <laughs> we usually yeah. just go. <laughs> <laughs> you did not know how to fucking drive at all. A oh, real talk, can I try? If you really want to. I want to try. I want to try. Put it in first gear. <laughs> Now, as you take your foot off the clutch, you have to equal pressure on the accelerator. So start revving. Start revving. <laughs> now put your foot on the clutch and change the second. Lee just left me. I think he managed to get it into second gear. Now it's chasing after her. Now I should take clutch off, accelerate. Go, accelerate, accelerate. <laughs> She's driving, she's driving. No sudden movements, you will flip the car. I can't believe I'm driving though. We're literally in the heart of the Aboriginal Territory land right now. Um, it's a little scary. So far we passed a couple of fires, a car on fire. Yes. Um, and we also just passed a couple of cars that were almost like they were in the middle of the road and it's like they were blocking us and it was so scary. And on the way here the other day, on the way to Uluru, the lady was telling us that, you know, the natives and stuff, they get bored in the middle of the night and they go wandering and they like to cause mischief. They literally buy or steal. Like they have, what, unlicensed plates and unlicensed stuff? Unlicensed cars. Yeah. Unlicensed cars and, you know. Cause trouble. They like to cause trouble with them. They literally burn with them. The tourists. Yeah. yeah, with the tourists as well. Um, and we've seen so many burnt cars, like I mean, literally hundreds. Past, yeah, literally literally hundreds. hundreds. One every kilometer. Literally. Yeah, pff, more than Honestly. that. Honestly. Do you know what? Yeah. We have to get permits and stuff to drive on this land. Like it's not just Australian land where, you know, whatever, yeah, we can like, go driving. Like it's actually, it's like private land almost. Yeah. Well it is, isn't it? It's, it's Aboriginal land. They can do what they want with it. Yeah. Exactly. And it's just so scary. But yeah, so hopefully we make it home safe. We're in a town that's like 12 hours away from Geraldine, which is like still the middle of nowhere, but we're so happy to be back. Hi, puppy. Hi. Hello. You're so cute, little puppy. It's like you come to me. Oh, it's so cute. Um, we found a dingo. <laughs> it's very vicious. Oh my God, this is the cutest little dog. Maybe we get a new dog. <laughs> Ooh. Replace Bruce. <laughs> well, it is ginger. <laughs> so Scott bought some food and we fed the little doggy. We think it's a stray dog. It's just wandering around. It's so sad. I want to take him home. And take her home. So yeah. sad. How do you know it's gender? Well, <laughs> it had nipples. 
the boys have nipples. But like Yeah, but it was like a dog with nipples. But how do you know it's gender? Well, I, I guess I don't. I could ask it its mental identity, it but no. Okay, I'm sorry, Frank. I named her Frank. <laughs> well, there you go. She's gender neutral. Like, she's got a bit of both. Frank has nipples. Even if she had a penis, does that make her boy, does that not? No. There you go. Yeah. She's a gender neutral up. dog. How dare you put pressure on her? She. Don't you mean Z? Z is a gender neutral dog. We're just across the road from Bruce's house. Do we have time for it? Yes, God. No, let's keep going. Let's go back to Uluru. Kind of miss the TBH. Let's go back. Who even needs a shower or a toilet? Oh my God. Or food, real food. Oh, she's here. I can't wait to be on ground. <laughs> <Is it dirt? laughs> oh, the beach. Like so much time to not be in the middle of the country. Get me out of here. Oh. I'm never, never again. I'm never leaving the concrete. The concrete jungle. <laughs> Back to the city for us. Literally, where's my flight? <laughs> supporting the economy <laughs> <laughs> because we bought their twenty dollar ice cream for however much they were. Oh she and she tried to arrest us. She said she was gonna get the car impounded. <laughs> you know, we have the same level of whatever authority. as the federal yeah authority is the federal police. We can impound your car and give you a ten thousand dollar fee. So what's your registration? I don't know it's a rental. <laughs> a car's a rental. <laughs>
in January. Bye, but then, uh, then Bali next year. Bali. <laughs> this is the travel squad. That's what we did. This is like, literally the travel trio. The travel trio. The travel trio. The Savannah sisters. The Savannah Savannah sisters do the tra travel trio. <laughs> <laughs> Can't even say it. The Savannah sisters do the travel trio. Done. Done. Ta-ta. Bye. Bye, Hola.